The Prophet sallallahu alayhi wa sallam said, you will die the way you live. If you live the life of disobedience, if you live the life of sin, then you will die the same way. And you will be resurrected the way you died. A police officer working in a Muslim country. He writes to a scholar and he says, that my return to the Almighty Allah, his return to the Almighty Allah, he writes, one occasion we were on a highway and we were parked up on the hard shoulder. And all of a sudden, everything's quiet. Me and my partner, we were talking. He says moments pass. And all of a sudden there was a big bang. The officer writes and when we look, when we look behind us, what did we see? A head on collision. There was a head on collision. He says we were running towards the car and we found two young lads. We took these two young lads out and we put them on the side. We were running to help the other guy in the other car. But what did we find? That he was dead. And when we returned back to these two, you, two young lads, we asked the young lads, that who are you? Yet again, there was no reply. My partner start instructing them that say La ilaha illallah. Say La ilaha illallah. But there was no reply. Yet again, my partner start instructing him say La ilaha illallah. Yet again, there was no reply. And when he repeated it again, he said, the, My partner instructed them to say La ilaha illallah. Yet again, there was no reply. And at this moment, as the Prophet wasallam said, you will die the way you live. If you live the life of disobedience, if you live the life of sin, you will die the same way. And when he was on the verge of dying, instead of uttering Kalima la ilaha illallah, he starts singing a satanic song. He starts singing a satanic song. He says, shocked by this. My partner start instructing him again. Say, La ilaha illallah. Yet again, the same thing. Both young lads were singing a satanic song. The Prophet sallallahu alayhi wasallam said, you will die the way you live. If you live the life of disobedience, if you live the life of sin, listening to music, then you'll die the same way and you'll be resurrected the way you die. He says moments pass. Waiting for the ambulance. The first one dies without the kalima la ilaha illallah. And the second one dies without the kalima la ilaha illallah. Knowing that the Prophet sallallahu alayhi wa sallam said, whoever says la ilaha illallah at the time of his death, he will enter Jannah. Knowing that the Prophet sallallahu alayhi wa sallam said, whoever says la ilaha illallah at the time of his death, then the fire of hell will be made haram upon this person. A second incident. A woman writes that could you explain to me that did my husband die a good death? Or did he die as a bad death? She writes that one occasion, me and my husband, we were sitting down on the sofa and watching a football match. We were watching a football match because my husband really loved football. And he was a supporter of Alan Shearer. And he used to love Alan Shira. On his clothes, he used to have an autograph by Alan Shira. In his bedroom, he used to have pictures of Alan Shira. He used to have cards of Alan Shira. She says one evening, 
when my husband and I we were sitting down and my husband said that my back is hurting and my legs have become weak she says I phoned the ambulance I phoned the ambulance and after about 20 minutes the ambulance arrives they bring a stretcher in and when they bought a stretcher in they put this my husband on the stretcher and when they put my husband on the stretcher my husband grabbed my hands and when he grabbed my hands he said to me look after the children I said to my husband that you 20 minutes you will be in the hospital and you will be back out and what happened they go towards the ambulance and when they jumped in the ambulance she says my husband was looking at the house it was like if he's not gonna return and the ambulance took us to the hospital and when they took us to hospital took us to the hospital and they checked my husband and he found out that he was dying of cancer and the cancer was so severe that he had reached his brain the Prophet wasallam said you will die the way you live if you lived a life of disobedience if you lived a life of sin you will die the same way and you will be resurrected the way you die she says that they put the machines on my husband and they said that your husband's only gonna last for another few days or maybe a couple of days or maybe a few hours so make the most of it she says that I sat next to my husband holding his hands and I instructed him to say La ilaha illallah. she says my husband started looking at the window and all of a sudden he started laughing he started laughing his laugh was so loud that the nurses came in the doctors came in and when the doctors came in she says my husband's body from the middle lifted and he started screaming start saying I'm Alan Shira, I'm Alan Shira, I'm Alan Shira. the machines turn off the Prophet Sallallahu said you will die the way you live if you live the life of disobedience if you live the life of sin then you will die the same way May Allah save us.